What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 22 for my playthrough on Animal Crossing New Horizons. So guys, in the last episode we completed the May Day event, visited Rover, and we collected bugs and fish for the new month of May. In today's video, we're going to be exploring the island, seeing what's going on, seeing if we have new characters such as like CJ, or Flick on the island, and I'm going to be working on my ravine building pass for that. So if you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys for all the support on the channel, all the likes, all the views, anybody who has subscribed. Thank you guys a lot, but I just want to show you guys my turnips because yesterday was Sunday by the time this is recording Yesterday was Sunday because I'm recording this on a Monday We got four turnips right there and hold up hold the phone. I'm not done just yet I'm not done just yet. We're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna show you the turn up upstairs Look at all those turnips. That's 6,000 turnips just chilling upstairs That's how much your upstairs can hold and then if you come over here to this room right here This room is going to be filled. We spent 1 million bells 1 million bells, maybe a little bit above a million bells on turnips. So we're going to be checking out prices weekly. I got my turnip calculator ready. I checked the prices this morning. They were only 90. I bought them for 103 each. 103, I believe. 102 or 103. Something around there. And this morning was 90. So we can actually check it again because they change every AM and PM. So we're that is actually what we're going to be doing first and foremost. But we got rain on the island, which is pretty dope. We had some rain on the island, so rare fish will spawn. I'm going to check over here. There's a fossil right there chilling. There's a fossil in my ravine. I, was, I just thought I'd peek over here, get everything that I need to do. We got Axel. Yo, we got the rain. We got everything going over here. I mean, these weeds right here. And yo, check out this butterfly I caught. Check out this butterfly. It is, what is it called? It's uh, Queen Alexandra's Birdwing. This thing is absolutely huge. I'm going to show it off to you guys. Because if you guys actually catch these things, they're flying around like pterodactyls out there. They are hilarious. I got to put it in my museum, which I will do when I assess more fossils and all that good stuff. But yeah, yo, rain on the island today. So possibly fishing, trying to catch some uh, new fish. Is there any other new fish I need? Oh, in the river. I need some in the river. And I think they're rare ones because they're worth a decent amount. Some of them are worth 2,000, some of them are worth 3,000. But I more so need them just for, uh, what's it called? More so need them for my museum. And there's an arcade machine I really need. But I'm here to check some turnip prices. Have they changed? Current price for turnip is 85. So they dropped a little bit. So I got to throw those in on my calculator later today just to see uh, when the spike will go. Because if you guys do the turnip calculator, you just keep up with your prices. And then eventually it will tell you what day would be your most optimal day to sell or when it can peak the most. But it's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. But let's go do our deeds. Let's go do our deeds. Look for our fossils. All that good stuff. So I'm going to go collect this. I'm going to hit my rocks. Look for my money rock, yo. Money rock. Dude, it's raining pretty hard. So that's pretty good for us. Like, it's not bad for us. Oh, we cannot dig there. Um, I guess we'll just try this here. Hopefully this isn't our money rock. No, no, no. I can't. I can't take the risk. I can't take the risk. Because that's 16,000 bells. I still have, uh, what's it called? I still have, uh, how many, how many bells do I have? I still have, um, 400,000, I think. Yeah, I saw 400 now. Can I not dig here? Okay, we'll just do it here. I'll corner myself in here. We'll dig there. There we go. Perfect. Watch, it's not going to be money rocking. It was wasting my time. It was wasting my time. But still, I, I like getting all these materials and all that extra mumbo jumbo. But not a lot of bugs are going to be out. So I guess today's fishing day once again. I I've been catching a good amount of the bugs. I caught the bandit butterfly. What I catch? I catch the pond skater and the, the other water bug in the last episode. And I caught one other one. Oh, and the Queen Alexandra's, which I just showed off to you guys. Which is a pretty cool one. But I have none of the new river one. New, new river fish. I got the what's it called? I got the uh, the Mahi Mahi and the Great Trevally, which was pretty dope. You guys saw me catch that in the last episode. That was pretty hype. And the waterfall's so loud. I love it so much, though. The waterfall's so sick. So what I want to do is, like I was saying, I want to kind of build a ravine. I want to put paths and trees in here. I think that can look pretty cool. I know I have my fruits to pluck as well. I have so many pears. I got to visit somebody's island soon and just slap up the pears. Just sell them all. I got over 200 pears, and I can just get rid of them and make some shmoney. I can make some shmoney. But yeah, like I said, yo, the waterfall is really loud, but it's so nice. I think it's such a cool touch, especially once we get done panting it all out, planting trees. I don't know what trees I should plant. Like, I want to plant pine trees, but then I don't at the same time. I'm thinking of planting, like, a certain fruit tree. Maybe pears, because they're my native fruit. But I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll find out later. I guess we will find out later. Let's head over here. Do all this, collect these weeds and all that. But I feel like our island's coming along pretty, pretty well. And I was actually thinking yesterday, do I really want the museum there? Because now my mind's starting to change. I might want to change up where the museum lays at, but I can eventually just do that later. Right now, I think it's pretty dope. I like where it stands. So we'll leave it there for right now and just see what's going on. I want to check the pier real quick before we do start. Because if there's a five out here, nope. Because now I can look for category fives off the pier. Potential Mahi Mahi or Great Chavali or Giant Chavali. And look at all these fruits. We're going to have to pluck them later. We are going to have to do the fruits dirty later. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Let's get it. Yeah, we got the fossil up there. I gotta go get them. 
The fossil lace, baby. This, I, I like I said, I, I don't like that. I don't like that. We gotta work on that. But right now, we're working on the ravine. Because I think the ravine looks pretty cool. But I just need to find a way that I can make the ravine, like, flow nicely into the island. You know what I'm saying? Because if you go up top, it's literally just walls blocking off everything. It's just like, bro, okay, that kind of doesn't look too, too good. But it's whatever. It's whatever. We will actually figure out a way to make it flow real nicely. Let's head over here. Branch that. Branch that. I gotta start collecting more bugs as well. I 100% gotta start collecting more bugs as well. As, like, I haven't really been collecting the bugs and storing them away for Flick for the next time he comes on here. So we're gonna have to start doing that. And Scorpion spawn. No more tarantulas for us, which is, uh, which is pretty cool. This one flows nicely because it leads up here. But, yeah, because this one leads to the highest arc. Now, this one actually flows really, really nicely. I just have to find out ways for the other ones. Let's head down here. Let's go hit up our other rocks and go to our main town square. Maybe someone's lurking in there. Maybe we got CJ on the island. I've been hoping for CJ. I really have been, but I haven't been able to find him, like, in forever. In forever. So, we'll head down here. We'll go do our daily deeds. Actually, I don't need that anymore. I do not need this, uh, this pole bolt coming around this way. I, do, I, still, I still do need to build another bridge. Look, yo, look at Cube, yo. Cube's chilling. I'm gonna check my beach first. See if maybe Gulliver's on the island. I haven't shut off Gulliver. Hold the phone. That's a five. I ain't messing with you. Actually, is it a five? I gotta catch it. I gotta catch it. That could be a six. And if it's a six, that could be a cold camp. Because it, it is raining. That's 15,000 bells. And it's... Only six is left on the island. It's a coal canth and an ore fish. For the month of May. And it's a five. I lied to myself. Ooh. Well, at least it's a C plus. Shut up. I am getting mad. I'm sick of you. I'm sick of you, little boy. Sick of you, little sea basses. I think sea basses and olive finders are, are all year round commons, which stinks, but still. They're just fun to make fun of. Yo, Gene, chill. What's up? Hold up. I gotta, I gotta do this. L relax. Axel, leave me alone. There's, there's a money balloon here. <laughs> all right, now what's up? What you want, fool? I got a lost item in the last, or when I was just messing around yesterday. I gotta give it to Hans. I know it's Hans. What do you got for me, actually? You want to talk to me? Give me another reaction? Let's get it, yo. Let's get it. Distress. Distress reaction. Give it up. I love that sound. Bim, 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 bim. You got distress. Thank you, Axel. You're a good old elephant in your raincoat. All right, let's actually open up this gift. Yo, look at all these fossils I have. I didn't... Oh, that's not the gift. That's a... That's a lost item. The gift's right here. Look at all these fossils I have, though. We got... We got... bladder has got some assessing to do. We got here. 10,000 bells. Yo, give that up to me. Give it up. Let me get my, uh, shovelay back out. Because I know I have three stones just chilling over here. Look at all these stones. Look at these stones. Ooh, another fossil. <laughs> Fuck that one up. Bro, I'm hoping CJ's just lurking in the middle of my island. Like, I'm hoping so much. That could be so sick. Let's get what here. Yeah. One dig. And another day. Corner that. This one's the money rock, isn't it? No, it is not the money rock. I believe there's... These are the last rocks. It's these, and there's one more over all the way to the right side. So we're gonna hit them all up and get all of our, our goodies. Okay, hit again? Yep, let's get it. Give me that. You can give me that. But all I'm worried about is that money rock. But we're stacking them with materials. I got so much. I gotta pay off my house loan. I think once I sell my turnips this time around, I'll pay off my house loan, which is uh, 1.2 million. So we'll definitely be able to make it back once we get a solid turnip price. And then I can be able to pay off my house loan and spend the rest back on turnips. Which is actually pretty, pretty nice. What's up, Annabelle? How you doing? It looks like you're moving out, but she just has her, that's her rain attire on. But here's the money rock. Here's the shmoney money rock. The only thing that stinks about the rain is, uh, not a lot of bugs spawn. Not a lot of bugs spawn. So that's why I think they should have, like, maybe, like, bigger sunlight making, uh, bugs spawn better. Because rain makes, a uh, rare fish spawn. But then, like, no bugs will spawn in the rain. But then, uh, they should have something for where, uh, bugs spawn a lot more. Or rare bugs spawn a lot more. And what's it called? Do not. And fish do not, but still, it's whatever. It's whatever. I don't judge. <laughs> we'll corner myself back here and just get these last remaining resources. Show me a gold nugget, y'all. I feel like I haven't gotten a gold nugget in forever. Like, in forever. Like, what the heck is this game problem? There we go. Slap all that up. Ah, I had ice in my mouth. <laughs> there we go. Pick up all my stones. My stony balonies. And then go around here. I actually want to check the beach on the left side real quick, just in case like a DIY bottle or something else is looking at like Gulliver. I haven't seen Gulliver in a good bit. I got my flowers here that don't need to be watered. There's a nice little fishy. Oh, hold the phone. <gasps> Gulliver! <laughs> hold the phone. Oh, I just put my shovel away. Because if you look in here, yo, my boy Gulliver's here though. Let's get it. Look in here. We got ourselves a fossil. Yeah! Yo, we got to talk to my, bo my boy Gulliver. You guys haven't seen him in a video yet, so time to show him off. Yo, he's showing here. And there's a DIY recipe. Let's get it, yo. Let's get it, yo. Let's get it. Gulliver, what's good? What's good, yo? My boy Gulliver's on the island. Passed out on the beach. Drunk, hungover. Something happened. <laughs> Waiter, somebody put salt in this water. 
You just gotta, so, what he does on the island, if you guys do not know, you just keep talking to him constantly. Constantly keep talking to him until he wakes up. Eventually, he's gonna wake up, and he's gonna realize that his phone is busted. And he cannot call anybody to come pick him up without all of his rusted parts. So, what you gotta do is dig in the sand as, like, uh, the little, where the manila clans come out, and find his rusted parts. Once you find all five of his rusted parts, get back to him. He'll send you guys a prize the next day, and he'll leave you a rusted part inside your, uh, what's it called? Your community chest. And I believe when you collect 50 of them, you can, you can uh, craft the robot hero. Like, that's what you need for the robot hero. So, that's pretty cool. So, every time you see him, you kind of want to do it to start stacking up. But I heard other things that go on. I heard that you can, what's it called? I heard instead of giving them the rusted parts, or instead of giving them the communicator parts, you can just hold on to them and get five rusted parts, because eventually they'll turn the rusted parts. So, I'm not too sure about that, but for right now, I'm just going to hand them back to him right now. Look at him. Dude, he looks so sick. A sailor seagull? Like, bro, yo, come on. Looking dope. My boy Gulliver, and he has an iPhone. Like that is an iPhone to a T. Come on, they're, they're saying they they uh they're not copying Apple. Like bro, get out of here. Yeah, Gulliver, I'll find your communicator parts. No, no sweat, no sweat, big dog. No sweat. Let me get them. I'm begging you here. Will you look for my communicator parts, please? I'll look for them, dude. I should be like, no way, yo. Kicks him in the water, do like a Spartan kick. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you guys haven't checked out my streams, head to the link in the description below. Gene25 on Twitch. We've been streaming so much since quarantine. Been tons of fun. We recently just did a Pokemon Sword and Shield viewer tournament, which was tons of fun. A lot of people came out. It was an awesome turnout. I really appreciate everybody coming out. And I want to start doing things like that for Animal Crossing too. Not like tournaments, but more so um, like uh, mini games on the island where we bet bells. Like that could be so much fun. That could be totally so much fun. Oh, I heard a Manila Clam. I heard it. Where is it? Where's my Manila Clam? But yeah, I heard it. Well, it's not a manila claim. It's going to be a rusted part. There it is. It's right behind this tree, yo. I knew I heard one. Can I get it? There we go. Is it a part? It is a communicated part. So there is one out of five. So Wisp kind of does the same thing. I only had Wisp on my island once. Once since this game has come out. I'm going to keep looking. I'm going to keep looking down here. What you want? Where is the communicator parts? Get out of here, fish. Am I chilling here? I'm going to have to go to a different part of the island? I'll be back, Goalie. I'll be back, Goalie. I'm going to go find some... Or communicator parts. I was gonna say rusted parts. There's my main area. My main, my main area is coming out good. It's starting to look better and better every single day when I do work on it. I'm not going over to this other side. I'll, I'll go back. I'll go back here. I'm looking for these rusted parts. We're not rusted parts, bro. They're communicator parts. Come here. Come here. And these things just spawn. Sometimes they'll spawn just real quick for you, which is so nice. And sometimes it'll be like this, which is kind of just annoying. And absolutely none of them are spawning. I guess I'll head up higher to this beach side. Oliver, yo, he looks so sick, dude. I love his design. Yeah, any over here? Don't make me go across the bridge. Is that a six? That might be a six. I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna catch it. Show off some fishing skills. Ready? Yeah, I think it's a five now. I'm looking at it, but yo, I'll take I'll take a six. Please be a six. It's a five. I know. It's a five. <laughs> I'm just hoping. Like I'm just like I can't turn on a cold can, but we got a sea bass, baby. Um, how much space do I have left? That's the real question. Do I have enough for yeah, I do have enough for the rusted parts. And I got DIY wires. Let's get it. What do we got? A magna library wall. The last thing I'd probably use. <laughs> Sweet, you got a magna library wall. Oh, no way. Cool, cool. Exactly what I wanted. I was dying to have it today. Holy fossils, yo. Your boy's got every single fossil in the book right now. I'm gonna head over here and see if the rusted parts are on this side. We got this bridge making things easier for us. Look at Julia Annabelle talking cube over here, just admiring the river. Let's get it, yo. Dude, where are these parts at? Absolutely none are spawning. Looks like I'll go back over the bridge. To the other side, yo. Like, I'm not playing your games, Culver. Did you lose the parts or did you not? They're not showing up here. Usually when you walk around and you come back to them, then usually they'll start spawning around them. So hopefully, hopefully, we'll start seeing some. Stand here for a second. Where they at, though? No. Bruh. Here's one. There they are. There, there they come. There's another one. Lucky number two. We need five. The Wisp are fun to collect, too, with, with a Wisp. Like his little body spirit parts. You just, they're just float, floating around. I just heard one again. I just heard one again. But they're just floating around with a, what's it called? And you just go up and you grab them with the net. Uh, here's one. Boop. Let's go. Three. Usually all the all these are communicator parts, but sometimes they're, they're the Manila. That's a pain, because you're just looking for Manila or the communicator parts at this time. Let's go. Two more, baby. Where they at? They starting to spawn. They starting to spawn out here. Goldie, where they at, bro? I think I heard one. I think I heard one. I think it was right here. Nope. 
I guess. Bro, where are you at? I thought I heard one. I thought I heard one. Come on. Come on, do it for the jeans online gaming community. Come on. We want it. We want these communicator parts. I'm gonna head over to the other side real quick. See if see if this side's holding them. Holding the fort down. There they are, there they are, lurking over here. For the jeans online gaming community, guys. Come on. We need the community parts. The communicator parts for the online gaming community. Let's run it. Let's run it, baby. <laughs> yeah! One more, one more. Run over. I'm done with your little side quest. I'm sick of it. Just want to show it off to the peeps. I'm telling you, it's up. It's up. It's up over here. I'm feeling it. It's lurking here. It's gonna pop out the sand. Where you at? Gotta be all the way on this side then. Come on. Julio's looking dope, yo, with that cool umbrella. Like, bruh, looking real spiffy. Looking real, real spiffy. Ban and, and yo, seriously? Seriously, is this last one's giving me this tough of a time? Usually I'm done in like 0.5 seconds. It's like, there you go. What is that? It's like category 4, which is probably a bass. A bass, baby. Hey, where you at? Bro, come on, just show me the last one already. Go over and just show me. Or do I already have five? No, I have four. Get out of here. I'm not tricking myself. I'm out! Over here? Little communicator part. Where you at? He's over here. Get him! Bro, dude, this is like being such a pain for me today. He just knows I'm on recording. It's just like, let's waste Jeans' time as he wants to do other things on the recording. And we won't give him the last rusted part. No, you guys want to play hard to get? I'll come over there. You want me to come over here? Is this what you guys want? It? Is this what they want? It? Let me pull out my shovel. Actually, I'll pull out my shovel when the time comes. I'm telling you, this is what they want. I don't think that they spawn. Hey, see? Oh, no. I thought I heard one. But I don't think they spawn in certain areas. I think they'll just, they'll just spawn randomly. Oh, that's a five off the pier. I got to catch it. I got to catch it. This has a chance of being the Great Trovali or a Mahi Mahi. Come here. Come here, baby. Hopefully it's a Mahi Mahi. Those things sell for a good price, and they look dope when you're pulling them out of the water. Come on, baby. Come on. Take the bait. Take it, baby. There it is. Come on, Mahi Mahi. Me. Come on, show it to me. Bruh! <laughs> sea bass! Get out of here, kid. It was off the pier, too. I'm not playing around. I heard it. I heard the last communicator part, guys. I heard the last online game of community part. <laughs> there it is. Right here. Better not be Manila Clam. Sometimes you get them. Come on. Yeah, let's go. Man, yo, I can't believe that was a sea bass. I wasn't dealing with that. I didn't want that at all. That was the last thing I wanted. So whack, yo. That is so whack. All right, let's take our vaulting pull back. Look, now they're spawning out the buns, but they're all Manila Clam. But now we're going to pull vote back across. Go talk to our boy. Go talk to our boy, uh, boy Gul Gulliver. Cash all that in. I want to go back to the residence hall. Go check like the Nook Miles, the ABD, all that good stuff. Finish that up. And I then I want to go assess the fossils and then maybe fish up a little bit. Get some newbies. Get some newbies right here. Let's see what we got. Hey, did you find them? Dude, they're right here. You knew you could count on me. You can always count on your boy Jeans. He's always hand them out. Always hand them out. Bro, I want to get sponsored by G Fuel. How cool would that be? How cool would that be, guys? So, G Fuel, you watching this? Hit your boy up. Hit your boy up. Let's go. That'd be so cool. I would love to get that. Have my little code and all that. Because I drink it often, I really do enjoy it. Because I'm a big fan of just, like, flavored drinks. Like, I've never been a fan of, like... Like, I like water. Like, obviously, everyone likes water. But I'd totally rather drink something with a little bit of flavor than just plain old water. Like, I've never been, like, a just a pure water drinker. So, like, G Fuel always hits the spot. Especially, like, in the morning. Gives me that little boost. And then with the hydration flavors as well, it's awesome. But there we go. We finished up Gulliver's little quest. Finished up his little quest. So what that means is he's going to send me a little gift tomorrow. Tomorrow in the mail. So just keep your eyes out in the mail whenever you do Gulliver. But we're going to head into this residence hall. We're going to see Tommy Nook over here. I don't even want to talk to him. I just want to go to this uh, little ABD center. I just want to see the Nook shopping, all that stuff. And then go head over to Blathy's. The Blathy's. And look, guys, I missed the day. I played, but I didn't check the, the, the section. I was like, bruh, there's really nothing we need in the Nook Miles. So I'm just going to go over here and see anything here. Oh, a Nintendo Switch. But Animal Crossing, that's pretty dope. That one is pretty dope. Pretty, pretty dope. Right, let's go assess our fossils. And then go, we have to hand in our butterfly as well. And hopefully we get some new fossils, but probably not too many. We have, how many do we have? Do we have eight or five fossils? Like, we're stacked up. 
We're stacked up. We will see when we get there. But onward. I guess CJ's not on our island. Sad face. Been wanting CJ here. But we're definitely going to be fishing up. We're definitely going to be fishing up. And I want to also do, uh, like I said, start creating a path in the ravine. Maybe plant trees. Maybe do our fruits and catch some fish. I definitely want to uh, start fishing because we are in the rain. So river fish will spawn, uh, especially the rare ones. That, that That is what's in the river right now. Are the rare category twos and ones. So what's up, Bladdies? What's good? And I can't believe Red hasn't showed up to our island yet. We had him once. We had him once. That is it. Oh, I don't want to make a donation. I would rather assess first. But we had him once on our island. Actually, no. The only time we had him was in the beginning. We actually never had him actually come to our island. Only time we got him was because he was, like, mandatory to come to our island because of the quest. Well, let's see. Let's go and give all this stuff up. We got here. There we go. How many fossils is that? Nine? I think it's nine, eight or nine. Ooh, more than one I see. Let us take a closer look. Yes, indeed, quite splendid. Alas, we do not have any of these fossils? What do you mean? How don't you have any of these fossils? Our fossil collection is coming in strong. I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll donate that big old butterfly. I think it's dope. I think it sells for like 4,000. It's like a very, actually expensive butterfly. Let's go, let's get it. Take that, just take my butterfly. Eek, a Queen Alexandra Birdwing. Ahem, I beg your pardon, bugs. I do detest them. <laughs> I love how he's always scared of bugs. Cracks me up. Please. No, no, don't tell me. I thought it said please take it. No, we don't want to hear about the dang Alexandra Birdwing. We want to go get our stuff done. Okay, so next quest. We're going to go start our path. I think we start our path and then we fish. I think we can make something look very, very cool and plant trees in the middle of it. Hey, yo, what's going on here? No, I don't want to wrap things up. I saw we did some things. It was probably SS fossils. For our Nook Mile Plus. What is that? Craft fencing for beautiful gardens. Nah, I'm good. Actually, I'll do it. I'll probably do it later. It's a times five. It's wonderful. Right, so we'll do that. And then we out of here. We out of here. Okay, so what I want to do with the ravine is I just at least want to make a cool path. I think I should keep it or make it a stone path or something along those lines. Something cool like that. But walk, 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 walk around the flowers. But I want to make it right here. So, and I want to have trees uh, planting straight down the middle. Do I have any fruits on me? I do not. <laughs> oh my god, we are so out of space. Can I eat a turnip? It's 10 turnips. <laughs> um, I have no fruits on me. I would love to destroy this rock. Let me go grab a fruit real quick. I can actually grab one just like chilling right over here. There should be one just lurking over here. Where you at, fruits? Are you kidding me? You're gonna tell me no fruits are here? Bro, what you mean? I gotta go over here now. I know there's a fruit right here. Yeah, give me my, my booty fruits. Come here. And come here. And come here. Okay, so we're gonna destroy that rock. I'm actually going to uh put us in island designer mode. But the real question is, what path do I want? What path do I want? I guess I'll just make it a dirt path for right now. Do I make it dirt? I think dirt could look probably the best. I'm not too sure. We'll figure it out though. We will figure it out. We, we got all the materials. We got everything we want to do with these paths. We got the fruits. We got everything. We got, we're gonna have to destroy this rock. But the real question is what path? I want a double path. A double two-sided path. So the path I'm going to want... Stone looks pretty dope. Brick looks pretty dope. Um. I think dirt. I think dirt is going to be the call here. I think dirt is definitely the call here. And then if I go here and I go one here and one here, I can make a double path. Yes, I can. Leading all the way to the inside. Yeah, that is what we're going to do. And then I can plant trees straight down the middle. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Let's get it. Right, I'm going to start off one and then I'll make my way back and destroy that itty bitty rock that we already hit up today. Yeah, I feel like, I feel like dirt is going to make it just, uh, I guess like go together a little well because you don't really want stone path i really don't want stone path here you know stone stone path does look pretty cool but i feel like the dirt path is going to make it look a little cleaner if i want to switch it up eventually i will but for right now i feel, I feel like the dirt path with the trees and the waterfalls is going to just look beautiful i feel like the waterfalls came out great i feel like just this, this whole ravine thing looks awesome it just looks perfect i'm gonna build here yaga that up yeah then the, it should leave one little path down the center and I can just go every other space, put a, what's it called? Put a nice little, uh, a tree. But I don't know which tree I should do. I guess peaches? I mean, peaches could be good, but I was thinking pears. I was thinking pears. I honestly was. But cool. Nope. Nope. I guess I'll figure out, um, or, no, I don't even know what trees I want to do. Not cedar. I don't think I want to do cedar. All right, that's fine. Uh, right there. We're going to step one over, and we're going to hit up this. And we're going to start doing this. Okay, so this is actually isn't taking us too long. I could play in fencing around this uh, water, too. If I really want to, like, a rope fencing. That can look pretty dope. There we go. 
I do all that. But the trees and the flowers and all that. Oh, I could do that. I could. Oh my god. I can plant trees in the middle and flowers on the outside. Bruh. That can look tight nice. That can look really nice, actually. And then maybe if I want to change up the path. Which, I don't, now that I'm looking at dirt, like, yeah, I could. But that'll, that'll be something I can just do later and test out later. But yeah, we're going to want flowers on the, along the right and left side. And trees in the middle. Yes, sir. Let's get it. I'm thinking peaches. I'm thinking we're going to have just peach trees lurking around here. And so peaches. Let me eat a peach real quick. Come here, peach. Eat that boy. The waterfalls are so loud. It's ridiculous. <laughs> well, we eat that up. Give me my, uh, I guess we'll just use a stone axe. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Slap that up. Beautiful. All right, back to construction. Give me my dirt pan. No, I didn't want to erase. Come on. Get out of here, kid. Get out of here. You're better than that. We're doing good. These paths actually do not take too long. I'm going to hit that up. I'm going to hit that up. Go there. Now, what flowers am I going to want? I would love to have all the pink ones. I'd probably match with the peaches, but the pe uh, pink ones are rare. I would have to breed a bunch of them. And then go from there. All right, so now let's dig our holes for our trees. Where do I want our trees? I'm going to start at the beginning. I'm going to start at the beginning. I think we're going to want one straight up here. Yeah, one tile up. Uh, one, two, three. I think three is a good number. One, two, three. Hopefully this all comes out pretty symmetrical. One, two, three. I think it might. And one, two, three. And one, two, three comes out at the end. Which, eh. I mean, I could do this. One, two, three and make the path another length. To make it symmetrical. I say we do that. I say we do that. I think that can look awesome. We gotta get some peaches as well. So I can go shake down the fruit trees in my uh, orchard as they are stocked up. They're beautiful. But first, I got to put stuff away and definitely sell some things to make plenty of room for fruits. There we go. Slap all that up. I'm, I'm going to have to destroy these cedar trees as well. I'm going to have to destroy the cedar trees as well, for sure. Because they just look terrible leading into here. It would look good if there was a backdrop. But yeah, definitely get the peaches up in here. I'm going to start planting the two other peaches while I have them. Just to exit out space. One, two. I need a shovel in my hands. Got my shovel. Hold that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We're going to plant that. Eat that over there. Slap, slap. Bat. Oh, dude. Our island's coming together well. It's coming together real, real well. All right. Let's go get our fruits. Let's go shake down our whole orchard. Finish this up. And then, actually, hold up. Your boy lied. We got to go here first. I got to go put things away. I got to go put things away. And hopefully, we made a dinosaur, but I'll definitely check it later. Because you guys know I want a dinosaur up in front, in front of a meat can. That'd be pretty dope. But come here. Look at my rotten turnip. Just been chilling there. Been chilling there. So there we go. Let's head in here. Let's put things away that we don't need, like our rocks and stone, any extra bundles we have. And all the fossils, because they're definitely taking up tons of space. Yeah, we got tons of turnips. It's hilarious. Sea bass. Um, I'll just sell that. We'll go put in storage. I can put an extra stack of uh, stone and iron. Dude, I'm racking up the this, this stacks of stone and iron. I love it. I love it so much. Still got that lost item. Three sea bass, they gotta go. <laughs> I might just sell that turnip, just not have it. It's only one turnip. There's literally the stack of 10 turnips. Um, I'm some weeds. Oh, yeah, I'll put weeds away. And I'm going to move this stone here. And then put this away. And we got plenty of space. And then we'll go down and we'll sell everything. I'll probably just sell that turnip. Not even going to lie. It's legit just 10 turnips. It's not like a stack of a hundo where I can actually make like a huge profit off of it. I'll probably just sell it right now. Just get a couple extra bells in my pocket. Let's run it. Let's run it. And I got to come back here later because there's a gaming machine in there. And I need more bells for it. I do need more bells for it. So I want to get all the gaming machines, all the pinball machines. I feel like everybody's doing this, but it's such a cool idea to have your basement as like a game room. It just looks too dope. It's awesome. Like, look at that. I think sick. I think they're like 56,000 bells. They're up there. Oh, and there's a grill. I want to definitely buy that grill too. So we're we definitely coming back here later. We are definitely coming back here later off screen to buy all that good. All right, so get this turnip out of the way. I'm not dealing with the turnip. Can I sell the lost item? Can I sell the lost item? <laughs> no way. Oh, okay. You can dispose of it. Yeah, you can dispose of that. Go, go for it. Oh, uh, he disposed of it. Cool. Because I tried giving it to Hansa one day, and he wouldn't take it. Because I think I got it the day before. Like, I got it... Like, the, the, the day after I got it, I tried giving it to him. And it, he wouldn't take it. I'm just like, bro, yo, what you mean? Like, what's your problem, dude? But, okay. We're going to head... Actually, I can just make a big loop this way. I'm going to pull out my net. I'm going to pull out my net. Where's my net? Do I not have a net? Or is it in my inventory? When I have a net on me, here it is. It's just not a favorited item. That's chilling. It should be. When I want to catch some good old bugs. But I'm going to head all the way around this way. I'm going to go get some peaches. 
I don't know if I should get all the fruits. I think I'm gonna get all the fruits right now. Sell them up and then buy the game machine while I'm there. <gasps> Another fossil! There's a fossil up there, bruh. Alright, yo, Julia, what's good? Julia, actually, I wanna talk to you because Julia's so sick. Well, hello! I take you're done giving me the silent treatment. <laughs> Yo, what do you mean? Cause I haven't talked to her. I see you running around the island, not a word of hello. I'm sorry, Julia. I'm sorry. But hello, how you doing? Hope you're having a good day. There you go. I talked to you. I gotta start talking to my villagers more. I've been I've been slacking on that. I've been definitely slacking on that. But let's get all these fruits off the trees. Yeah, baby. You guys already know, yo. We rack up this money with the fruits. We rack up this money with the fruits. Give me all that. Yeah, so not bad day today. We did Gulliver. What else we do? Get a bunch of fossils. We're finishing up our ravine, planting our trees. I'll probably plant the flowers on my own time and maybe change the path to stone. or Because I feel like stone kind of just goes good because I want like a different like modern look. Kind of. I feel like that can look a little bit better. And then what's it called? And then I want to catch fish. We're definitely going to be doing that in today's video. I love fishing, especially in the river. All the ones and twos will spawn so we can definitely get some cool new fish. It's pretty dope. So give me that. Give me that. I just got to make sure I don't pick up these floor lights. These four lights. And then with all, everything I sell, I can definitely buy the, what's it called? The game machine and the grill from the shop. It's gonna be dope. Take that down, shake a shake 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 Did I finish that first row? No, I did not. I only did the first two trees, and then I, for some reason, I went to the total other side. Give me that, give me that. Is that all the fruits here? Let's see. The X button, see, yo. Always hit that X button. You can see through and uh, find all the fruits that you did not grab. But, yo, I'm a huge fan of this orchard. Every time I see the orchard, it just looks better and better. Like, the trees are in the perfect length away from each other. Like, the, just one one top tile here and two up. Like, oh my god, it looks so good. It looks magnificent. Magnificente. We get all these fruits, and he makes money off it. But yeah, I think ever since I started investing into the stock market, you know, my money's been going up and up. Because the amount I get back from the stock market is usually double of what I paid, and then I put the whole doubled amount back into it. And we just start racking it up. We just start racking it up like crazy. We got all them. I'm just going to keep shaking. Shake it, shake it. But like I said in the beginning of the video, I have to start really like uh, collecting more bugs. Like I've been slacking on my wasp collecting and all that, so I definitely gotta start doing that a lot more in order to get more bugs for when Flick comes. Cause I really don't want him just to come and it just be a waste of my time as I, I will not have like any bugs or anything. You know what I'm saying? Like I need as many bugs as I can get. Maybe I gotta go uh, tarantula, not tarantula farming. It is now scorpion farming. So I could probably do that because they're eight thousand a pop. And I believe in the next month, uh, uh, or or maybe the month after. The next month's going to be awesome for fishing. Sharks come? Like, bruh. Rain is going to be so huge. I'm just going to be fishing for sharks all day, and CJ is going to make me tons of money. But uh, in a couple months or next month, we get the beetles for the bugs, which are really, really rare. They start to sell for over 10000 per bug. Like, bugs really don't sell for that much. The highest we ever had was 8000 So it's going to be amazing for when the beetles come in there. Oh, I didn't do that side of the apples. Come here, apples. Come here, apples. Give me the fruit skis. I always love collecting the fruits. It's so peaceful. <laughs> it's so peaceful. Come here, apples. I got you, boys. Got my apple lace. I think all the fruits look cool. I think they all look so cool. I don't know. Something about it. I, I think they should have added more. I heard they're going to add farming, which would be cool. Like, you can get tomatoes and all that. Like, bruh. I would love to have a cool farm. That is something I really want to build. I actually might build that all the way up on the cooktop where the gym is. Is a flower garden. Like, a nice garden. Like, have all the different flowers. Start breeding all the gardens and just have rows of every single flower. I think that can definitely look amazing. Let's see. Got all of them right here. Come here. And come here. Come here. They're, they're all just chilling here. And right here. And so we should have all of them. We do. We are on to the pears, yo. The pears. I am stacked up on the pears, man. That's what I got to do. Next stream I do, I got I to gotta get some or be able to go over to somebody's island with every single stack of pear and just sell them all. I, I legit have too many. I've been saving up for weeks now. Bagworm does spawn out of here. Get out of here, bagworm. I'm not dealing with you. Not dealing with you. I really do like my new face cam, uh, face cam, what is it called, border, I guess? I think it looks dope, it has that little slick loop around it, and it, the little shine goes around it, it looks so cool. I'm a big fan, I have it for my stream, but this one's, the one for my stream has a little, like, thing under it for, uh, top donator. But this one doesn't have it, so it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool. Well worth it, well worth it. Give me all that, pair, pair me, pair me. I'm hyped for the Sword and Shield DLC and, the uh, new Mario games coming out, like, that's gonna be so much fun. It's legit gonna be so much fun, and it's gonna be a lot more cool content I can bring to the channel. Like, I'm so hyped for Mario. Like, it, that's four games. I, actually, they announced, well, it's leaked five games, but they're definitely coming. They're definitely coming. So, it's gonna be 3D World Deluxe, uh, Galaxy HD Remake, uh, Sunshine HD Remake, and 64 HD Remake. And the final one is gonna be a brand new Paper Mario game. Like, yo, I'm gonna be doing all of them. I'm gonna be cranking out the content on the channel. Cranking it out. I just don't know. I'm going to have to take a poll of which Mario game you guys want me to do first, whether it's 64, Galaxy, or Sunshine. 
But I, th I feel like it's going to be either Galaxy or 64, but that's a tough decision. It's going to be a tough decision. Or I might just do both of those at the same time. Yeah, you know, maybe just run them at the same time. That'd be pretty dope. There we go. Pick up all the fruits. We are almost uh, finished up with this orchard. Or at least collecting in this orchard. Let's see. There's a Peaches Lane here. Look at this. This was from last time. I must have missed it. But it's cool. Like, if you miss it, they just stay for next time. I think it's kind of funny. Pick all that up. Give me that one. This one. Come here. And come here. But yeah, I need four fish in the, what's it called, in the river. I don't think we're going to get all four. It's the angel fish, the beta fish, and two other ones. I would know once I get them. But they are dope. They are dope. Actually, the angel fish, one of them sells for like 3,000. It's only like category two in the river. So I feel like in the rain, we can maybe smack up a few of those and save them for uh, CJ. That could be actually a good amount. Just a bunch of those little guys, which is awesome. So the river fish are not bad here. There we go. And we finish up with the pears. Or the, not the pears. All the fruits. I was going to say peaches because this is what the main thing we were looking for. Now I can actually go run over there, slap them in there, sell the rest, and hold on to the peaches. Let's get out of here. Let's get grooving. Yeah, yo. Yeah. Let's go, dude. I cannot wait for all this to grow. I feel like the ravine is going to look so cool, especially now that the, the secret beach or the so-called secret beach has a meaning to it now. That what's called just going to spawn there. Red. Every time you saw him painting. And we're going to need red a lot. So let's go over here. Let's grab ourselves this... uh. A shovel. I believe they can plant one right here. Yeah. I right, grab our peaches. I'll just grab them from here. We're going to plant the item. Slap, slap, slap. But I feel like peaches are just so vibrant and cool. And then I feel like maybe I should start uh, farming those pink uh, wind flowers. Because they can definitely match these things and uh, just glow really well. Oh, yeah. We got a new song. I believe the songs change every hour on the hour. So it should be like 1 o'clock now. Yeah, the time just changed to 1 o'clock. The song, the music changes every hour, which is pretty cool. Bam, bam. All right, to the shop. We're going to go finish off this video by going to the shop, selling these fish, and then collecting some new fish. Not selling the fish, selling these fruits, and then fishing for some new fish, which is dope. And I want to buy, you guys know what I want to buy, the grill and the arcade machine. Let's get it. Now, I'm going to talk to Tommy. I'm not going to talk to you, Timmy, because Timmy's always doing all the work. So let's go. We're going to give Tommy some action here, and we're going to sell all these. Again, keep the pairs. I'll sell this one weed. Eat the pears. Go here, go here, go here, and bang, yo. What is it? It should be about like 70, 70 to 75,000. It's gonna be a nice little batch. Let's see. We did plant a few. We did plant a few of them, so that's why it's under 70. We planted five or four of them. But there we go. Beautiful. Come here. New game machine. Get over here. Dude, this looks like Asteroid Barrier arcade combat game. There we are. Limited supply, so act fast. Give it. Give it here. 64,000 smackaroonies. I'll take it, though. That is sick. That is sick. And then I want to come over here and buy the grill, just so I have it for my, what's it called? For my island, first of all, I can put it in people's yards, and I can have it in my shop as well. My, uh, what is it? My catalog, that's what, this thing's cheap compared to the arcade machine. Okay, we finished the Nook Mile as well, I'm gonna actually click on this, and see what that's about. It was just spend bells. Spend bells! And I want to actually check out the, the stock market, or the stock market, uh, DIY, uh, uh not recipes. The missions, I guess you want to call it? Bell ringer? Where are they at? More loan payments, bulletin board. The stock market. So this is, what is this? Earn? What is it? Or is this pay? This has got to be earn. This is earn bells from there. So we're going to hit that million next time. Ooh, wait. There should be another one here. Miles for stockholders. Uh, that's only one. Is there one, like, pay for turnips? I guess not. I cannot wait to finish all these. Like, that is something I totally want to do. They added actually a lot. Like, I didn't think they added a lot at first. A lot of, what's it called? of nook miles achievements but now that you look at it like they did actually add a lot considering each one has like about five which is pretty dope but give me the rod it is time it is time we're catching some newbies guys we catch some newbies the best part about every single month you guys already know it is a new fish and insects coming in here get out of here from mr category four little bass over there we're looking for twos and ones here looking for two twos and ones here's a nice little two come here the rain should be able to help us out because rare fish will spawn the rain and i feel like these uh, category twos are rare ones Considering they sell for more and all that good stuff, and we haven't been able to find them. Let's see what we got. Bluegill, yo. We ain't looking for these ones. We ain't looking for the bluegills. We've been catching the bluegills and the Karushi and carps out here. Like, yo, those are the last uh, things we want. The last guys we want. All these uh, mantises chilling out here. Oh, that was a one. Oh, man. I wanted that one. I'm gonna hop across. I'm gonna hop across here. Play this side of the field. Actually, let's uh let's check that over here first before we hop. There she is. There's a nice little fishy. Come here. Come here. Let me pull out my rod for you. Come here. I'm going to catch you and bring you to the Jeans Online Gaming Community. Come on. Join the Jeans Online Gaming Community. <laughs> I've been saying that for like the past two days. It's stuck in my head. Come here, fish. Give me something new. Is this a one? 
Might be a one. That's a one or two. Lugo, bro, yo, get off of me. You're the last guy I want. Get out of here. Yo, here's a one. Here's a one. This could be something new. Come on, fishy. Rain's gotta help me out here. Rain's gotta help out your boy. Come on, what we got? Oh, bitterling, dude. Is that a bitterling? No, it's a pale chub. Bitterling's gone. Oh, dude, the bitterlings were the worst, yo. Pale chub. I already have pale chub as well. So looking over here. Here's a nice little two. I see a pond skater over to that right. Come here, fish. You tell me you don't see that fish? Better get out of my face, little boy. It's a beautiful cast. Yeah, I know you see that one. Oh, you took it early on. Okay. I see you. Yes! New fish! Beta fish! I think it's gorgeous. I think it's gorgeous, yo. What's up, Axel? How you doing? There's a one over here. I'm looking for the angel fish too. Hopefully I can get at least two new fish. Maybe do I know you see that swim up. Yes, yo, get a beta fish out here. Come on, show me something new again. Ah, bluegills, yo. The bluegills are just being terrible today. Bluegills are just being terrible today. I think beta fish sell for like 2,500, which is actually pretty solid. Oh, here's a two. My cast have been on, yo. Your boy's been practicing. Join the fishing tournaments. <laughs> oh yeah, newbie? Nope. Loach is looking at me with reproach, guys. Not a fan. Get it out of here. Get it gone. Get it gone, kid. Yeah, cool. We caught the beta fish. Yeah, there are th four new river fish. We caught one of them. I think I can catch at least two here. Uh, I, I don't know if I'll catch the rest uh, today, off screen or something. Sometimes I like to save them for throughout the month. Give me something to do later on. Give me that. We got. Come on. Show me that angel fish. I don't know if angel fish is category one or two, but I know it's one of them. So I'm just keep catching them all one and two, ones and twos. I caught a bluegill. Yo, what is up with these bluegills, yo? How many we caught? And again, to a good amount of bluegill. Anything over here? But yeah, the beta fish, we got that. Thank you, Rain. I can eat that. Yeah, yo, dude, my cast has just been too good. It's been first time in these fish. Take it, buddy. Take it. He doesn't want it. Oh, dude, I looked up at the camera real quick. I looked up at the camera. You guys saw me do a quick peek. I was like, and then I, I thought he took the bait. Kind of sad about it. Kind of sad about it. Let me get across. Come on, can I eat? There we go. Eat that. Oh, that was probably the fish we were looking for. But probably the one that we lost. Look at his cast. Yeah. I told you, dude, my cast has just been on. They don't want the smoke. There we go. Reel that one up. That's a crucian card. But yeah, I know there is a uh like a DIY achievement where to catch a hundred fish in a row. In a row, like isn't that insane? I feel like that's absolutely insane. Without messing up or anything. A like hundred? That's a lot. I feel like I'd, I'd eventually mess up. But still, that is something we're gonna have to do. Maybe I'll do that in like a stream or something. That could be cool. Another crucian carp. I'm not dealing with you, crucian carps. Get off me. What space we got left? Oh, we got plenty of space. We got plenty of space. I'm telling you, we gotta find a new a new fish. Where they at? Where are these fishes at? I'm gonna keep lurking around here. Oh, I scared that one off. Hunk of junk. That was probably one that I needed as well. <laughs> There's a bass. Get out of your kid. I cast and scared off. Hey, that's a bass, right? Should I catch it? No, I like know it's a bass. No, I'm gonna catch it just in case. It's a bass. So I, I know it. I don't think there's any new category fours yet besides bass here, so. I think all fours in the regular river are bass. Maybe in the cliff tops you can find something like that. Ooh, ooh, newbie. Come here. A cast, dude. I'm just on, baby. Give it up. Come on, you gotta give me a new fish for this. A cast like that? Give me something new. Show it to me. Bro, stop it with these Karushian carps and the what's it called? It's the Karushian carps and the. the the diggity dogs, the the, little, the blue the bluegills, not dealing with them. But luckily we do have the rain like that. I don't think we would have caught that beta fish without the rain. I feel like these are a little bit rarer fish. Like I said, so get out of here, four. I'm not dealing with you, four. Scare him away. I'm not dealing with him. Like I said, come out of here. Right, we gotta hop across here. Oh, one more, one more new guy. I need one more new guy. I'll catch him in later. I'll catch him in later. I'll stop until I get a new guy. Yeah. Unless I can only catch them on the cliff tops. I might have to I might have to look into that, guys. I think they're just river fish. Lugo, bro. Get out of here. Oh, it's probably gonna be cliff top river fish. And I didn't look f further into it. Oh, here's a one. I feel like one of these are a one. I haven't seen a lot of ones. It's just been a bunch of twos. Come on, baby. I'll take another beta fish if it's one. They're dope. Mmm, pale chub. A neon tetra. Oh no, this is a neon tetra. We do have a neon tetra already anyway, so that's fine. That is fine. We don't want him. 
Get him gone. Here's another one. Throw me a newbie. Okay, that, that was just awful, jeans. That was just the worst cast. Luckily, this one's gonna make up for it. You tell me you don't see that, little fishy. I'll cast in that exact, same exact spot, and I know you'll see it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Little fishy. Come on, take it. Be something new. Be something new. Come on. What you got? What is that? Oh, that's a new one, is it? Yes! We caught a nibble fish. Let's go. Another new fish. That's what your boy wanted. Nibble fish right there. So we got the nibble fish and we got the beta fish, which we're going to have to cash in. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I just need the angel fish and something else. Cube, don't look at me like that. <laughs> it's usually the I want to leave face. Uh, I don't want that fish. I'm at this other side, though. I'm just like, get out of here. Despawn you. Anything over here? Yo, we got a nibble fish, baby. He looked kind of like a loach at first, but I was just like, that doesn't look exactly like a loach. It's a nibble fish. Got a big fish, get out of here. And that little bug on the water. Anything over here? Another big fish. Yo, get out from me, big fish. All right, I'm going to do one more path around. I hear a, what's it called? I hear a balloon. There it is. I knew I heard one. Snipe that. Three, two, one. Ugh. Snipe that. Show me 30,000 bells. I pulled 30,000 bells out of it once. Pretty tough. Let's see. What we get? 5,000. I'll still take 5,000. Give it up. Let's hop across. One last path around. Looking for that angel fish. That could be phenomenal. That's like one of the ones I was really looking forward to getting. CJ not on our island. I really want CJ to be on our island. Get out of here, big fish. The bass. What is up with all these big fish, Molly? Get out of here. Looking forward to the twos and ones. Come on. There's another big fish. I got to despawn. Yeah. Yeah, I know you see that. Get out of here, kid. Get out of here. All fours, yo. Bunch of fours. There's a little two. I don't know if the angel fish can be a two. I think it can. Or at least another one is. Yo, I see you, cube. Leave me alone. I'm trying to fish for new guys. Well, let's end on a high note. Come on. I'll take another beta fish. Or is beta fish a two or a one? I don't even know. Let's see. There it is. Beta fish. Beta fish two. I'm, I'll keep that one and save that one for your boy, uh, CJ. Hmm. There's another fish. Get it. I want to end. I was going to end it, but I saw this fish. Come on. Let's go back to back betas. Or something new. Let's get it. What we got? Oh, back to back betas. Yo, the luck's coming up. Yo, betas are type nice. I'm saving them for CJ. Like I said, they sell for like 2,500, I think. Which is solid. Like CJ, that's 3,700. They're like the wasp for CJ. Head back over here. I'm feeling good. I gotta, I gotta keep pushing my luck here. We're catching some nice beta fish. Like, yo, here we go. Here's a one. I like Again, I don't know if angel fish is a uh, category one. So I'm gonna catch all the category ones. Ah, uh, nah, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a pale chub. That's a pale chub right there. One last look over here. Get out, get out of here. I keep saying one last look, but then it just keeps turning. I want one more catch. One more two or one. That is what we're going to end it on. So we're going to keep looking. We're going to go around this side. We're going to go around this side. I love having the bridge there. I got to get benches for that, that place right there. That little center. Get out of your fish. I'm not dealing with you. Come on. Who's going to be my lucky final fish here? There you are. Lucky final fish. And it be something new. Or another beta fish. Like, I'll take beta fishes all day. What we get? What we get? Ah, bluegill. Bluegill. Come on. That's what we got to end on. But, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As the next episode, we're going to be finishing collecting up some fish. Hopefully, it will not be raining, even though I love the rain, so we can catch some new bugs and all the good stuff and work on our island. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.